I'm so disgusted at this fucking pimple. Like, oh my god. Hey guys, it's Tyreek and you're watching Toast and Grits. And in today's video, we're going to be talking about my skincare routine. Um, the products I'm using in today's video are going to be the Neutrogena uh, Pink Grapefruit Acne Oil Free um, Face Rash. The MAC Lip Scrub. I'm going to be using the Pumpkin Mask from Peter Thomas. Um, Nivea Cream. Um, Miss Spa Renew Radiant Glow Paper Mask. Um, MAC Lip Conditioner, and last but not least, Smashbox, um, Photo Finish Primer Water. Let's get this video started. Alright, so first things first, I'm going to be using my Neutrogena Oil Free Acne Wash and Pink Grapefruit, which also contains vitamin C. It has microclear technology, it exfoliates, clears breakouts, and it smells so damn good. Use this twice a day, morning, and before bed. To wash your face, you're going to, of course, wet your face first. Apply a dime-sized amount to your hand and begin to wash your face. The microbeads ensure a fresh, younger-looking result. Ooh. Next, I'm using my Peter Thomas Pumpkin Mask, which is good for oily, dry, normal, and a combination of all different types of skin. Use to exfoliate and eliminate any dullness, aging, or congested complexions. Most people use this to repair uneven skin textures, wrinkles, and clogged pores. To use, you're going to apply a thin layer to skin using your fingertips to gently smooth around face. Leave on for 3-7 to seven minutes, although I usually keep it on longer. Whatever. Then rinse thoroughly. Prefer to use this once or twice a week. Oh, and if you love Starbucks Pumpkin Spice Latte, this smells just like it. Next, I'm using the Mist by Brightening Paper Mask, which leaves a radiant glow. You're going to first unfold the mask from the packaging and pat onto clean and clear skin. Never do a paper mask on dirty skin. That's probably, like, really nasty. Um, and also, be careful when you take it from the packaging because it's so fragile. Um, you're going to pat it onto your skin, like, until you get it real nice and even and how you feel like, you know, it's comfortable. Um, you're going to turn your timer on for 20 minutes and you're just going to relax. And then lastly, you're going to remove it and pat the remaining residue like on your face and it's like, it kind of got like the sticky feel. Now I'm using the MAC Lip Scrub. Um, the flavor is Summer Berry. It smells so good. I got a friend who works at MAC and she recommended this one. Although she was scared to kind of recommend a purple one because she said one of her friends tried it and it kind of stained her lips, but um, my pigment is a little darker so it doesn't stain, I guess. And yeah, it smells super amazing. Just scrub it, make your lips so soft. And if you smoke, I'm telling this to you for a friend. If you smoke, marijuana anyway, you need to always exfoliate your lips. Always keep them scrubbed and clean because you do not want them to turn. And I think that this is a good product for that. Like, it costs a little something, but it's worth it if you smoke and you don't want to look like you smoke. Because Now I'm using my favorite face moisturizer ever, which is the Nivea Cream. Um, I don't really even know what to say about this besides it's just like the best product I ever brought to moisturize my face with. Like I just put it in sections and then I just like rub it in. After I finish rubbing it in, it gives me like this smooth, dewy looking glow. Yeah, like that's, that's that Nivea does it. That Nivea has that glow in there. Now I'm going to use the MAC Lip Conditioner, which is, I want to say like, 
one of the best things you can buy for your lips. <laughs> um, just apply like a small layer of it. It does kind of come off a little glossy. So if you're a guy and you're going to wear it, do it just like how I'm doing. Only apply a little bit. And now I'm using my Smashbox Photo Finish Primal Water, which is like, I don't know. It's lit. The sales associate, when I was in Sephora, she basically, I was gonna get this or like this tart one, which smelled like um, oranges. I think it had vitamin C. Well, I know it had vitamin C in it. And um, I've already tried it before. So I was like, let me just try something different. And she recommended me to use Smashbox. And she said that it had diamond dust in it. And that was the reason I bought it. And I'm not exactly sure what the hell diamond dust is still as I make this video. And by the way, that little clip in the beginning of the video literally happened before I did this video. So I'm very happy about my results. And this is what I look like at this. So that pimple thing is it's still right here, but but you don't really see it like that. And what else? But yeah, you don't, you don't see it no more like that. So if you ask me, those masks and shit work. Buy that shit.